Hey you guys, welcome back to another vlog. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. If you guys have not watched my previous 7 videos during the Vlogmas season, I will leave the Vlogmas 2021 playlist linked down below. Also subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you guys don't miss any of my uploads for the rest of December. I will be posting every single day until December 25th. Come along with me on this journey and my first ever Vlogmas. I'm having so much fun. It's just a great time around here and I really love that you guys are enjoying them if you're new here welcome as you guys can see by the title of today's video i am going to be getting a tree for my dad's house a christmas tree and setting it up with my mom i am sitting in the parking lot of home depot right now my mom said they sell ornaments do they sell ornaments mom i think so yeah all right so i guess they have like we'll a whole christmas him. section in there yeah he has a tree from like previous years but it's not that nice so I want to get like a really nice one and all new ornaments and just make it so fun and beautiful I would have shown you guys my mom and I setting up our tree at her house but we did it the day after Halloween so yeah we're those people who set up literally a month before Christmas but me personally I just feel like what's the point of doing all the work to set up for it only to be up for a month. So I would have filmed that whole thing of us setting up and doing all the decorations and everything like that. But since it was so far in advance and we really were ahead of the game, I didn't want to like give everybody, I don't know. I just feel like it wasn't time for like Christmas videos yet and holiday videos. So I didn't film it. I did show you a little sneak peek of what the house looks like on Vlogmas day one. So if you guys would like to see how we set up that house, then check it out. I will leave it down below. But today, since it is the vlogmas season and obviously time to set up for christmas i'm going to bring you along on how we are going to be setting up my dad's house because i'm super excited it's going to be super fun i think we're going to go to like home, home goods, goods yeah. or home sense or something like that and, and get, get like pillows, pillows yeah. and maybe some like festive blankets little decorations here and there just to make it like extra fun and nice because a tree is like yeah, that's festive, but not the va ba boom that I'm imagining in my head. I'm gonna have to put down the seats back here. Hopefully it'll fit. We're getting like an eight foot tree, I think. But yeah, I'll bring you guys in there, show you what we're thinking about, show you what we're getting, do a haul after we get back from Home Goods. So if you guys would like to see the rest of what we do throughout this video, be sure to keep on watching. Ready? Yep, let's go. Let's go. Okay, so we just left Home Depot. They didn't have that good of a selection whatsoever. By the way, I don't know if I mentioned, but we're looking for four, four, four. Mm -hmm. We're looking for an artificial tree because they're just easier to keep up with and they last forever, obviously. So yeah, that's what we're looking for. I showed you guys a little glimpse of what they have, but nothing that we were in love with. And the one that we did like, of course it was out of stock. Just, oh my goodness. Okay, so we have made it to Hicks. It's a nursery and they have so many trees, real ones, like wrapped in the nets. And we're pulling in here and I've never seen so many cars have the trees like attached to the top of their car. It looked so festive. I wish I got it on video, but I'll show you guys. We're parked literally right where all of the trees are like netted up they're all pre-done so you can literally just come and pick one up and then they have a whole bunch of real ones right there look somebody's taking one right there this is just so fun <laughs> okay let's go doesn't matter if the snow is falling or the windows in the rain is pouring it will always be christmas in my heart
just left Hicks. We got a tree, as you can see. We ended up getting a flocked one just because it looks so much prettier. His house just finished getting renovated and it's all super modern, super white, bright, clean. And I just feel like this tree would go so much better in his house than like just a bold green one. So yeah, really looking forward to decorating that. We are now here at HomeSense, if you guys can see. And my mom and I came here about a month and a half ago to get so many decorations for her house and now we are here getting stuff for my dad's um gonna get throw pillows ornaments all stuff like that so i'll show you guys inside there really getting in the spirit that place was so beautiful there were so many little kids running around santa was there all the kids were taking pictures with him there was such a long line to take pictures with santa it was so cute all the little kids were literally staring at everything it was so bright and beautiful and the christmas music was playing there was like a live band playing playing trumpets and all those type of instruments. It was just so beautiful. And if you guys are in the Long Island area, I definitely recommend going there. It's just so nice to walk around and take your kids there, cousins, little ones, or even go if you're my age or even older because my mom really enjoyed it and she's a grown up. So yeah, gonna go into here and then see you in a sec. Look at that Santa. Love you. Oh, they have the flock trees here too. They literally have all the same stuff as when we came here. So cute. You should get him a big ass gnome. <laughs> that one is so cute. The one that stands up, you should put it by his front door. We got these two guys so far. They're literally huge, but they go on the floor. So I feel like it'd be perfect for like by a front door or something like that. We're just leaving home sense. And of course the camera is not gonna really capture what the sky looks like, but holy shit. It looks so cool. So we just got a whole bunch of stuff, some throw blankets. We're gonna use this as the tree skirt and then some stuff in here to put under the tree. And we're actually gonna go to TJ Maxx and Target and or Target and see what else they have because we still can't find ornaments that we like. Okay, so we just left Target and we got one little tiny bag of things. They had no ornaments whatsoever. Oh, Their wow. entire Christmas section was wiped clean. We are now at Michael's because I looked online and it says they have some ornaments and we're hoping for some luck because right now it looks like he's gonna have a bear tree. And if not, we're gonna go try to go to Costco maybe. Yeah, we're just have. really running to every store around town to try to find some ornaments. So as you guys can see, we just got a whole bunch of ornaments. There's some more on the floor. And for some odd reason, they didn't come with hooks. So we're going back to Target to get ornament hooks because Michael's was completely sold out. And we just remembered we didn't even look at the throw pillows. So we're gonna go look for both of those things. Back like we never left. Home away from home. <laughs> You guys, we did it again. We've been in Target for literally an hour and a half and got so much stuff, more stuff than we needed. We got four pairs of Levi's. We got blankets and pillows and some clothes for Bianca and Nelson, some boy clothes. I'll do a haul when I go home, um, but we literally got so much stuff. We just go overboard every single time and I know that you guys can relate because you can't tell me you go in Target and only leave with one thing. So it's basically like we're setting up a house that's brand new just in case you guys are like why the hell are you going so overboard. It's because there's literally no Christmas decorations in his house right now. So we basically have to start from the ground up and I'm so excited. We just got out of Target, as you can see, all the bags behind us, and I just realized how late it is, how long we were in there for, and we were not expecting to do that, but you know, Target, whatever, whatever. So, we decided that we are going to do my dad's tree tomorrow so that we aren't so tired. We have all day to do it. It'll be great lighting for you guys to watch it, and it'll just be like a whole fun video. In the meantime, we're gonna go eat, have some dinner, we're starved, and I'll see you when I am in mi casa. <laughs> so it is now 10.24, and I decided to lay out everything that we got from Target today. Two sets of socks right here. This is all my mom's stuff. 
this cute beanie, these two scarves that are super cute. They're almost like a turtleneck scarf. They just pull right over your head. These three pairs of Levi's from the men's section. They have really cute Levi's and a lot of different washes and stuff. So I highly recommend if you guys are interested in getting a pair. These were $50 each and that's honestly a really good price for Levi's. And then she got this really oversized Levi's hoodie. Then over here, we just got this mirror that's double-sided. This is a 2022 calendar for my Tiroro. And I can't believe we're almost in 2022. This is honestly crazy. And then starting with a whole bunch of stuff for Bianca, we got her these two long sleeve tops, this really cute graphic tee, this whole pile of sweatpants and leggings type pants. Yes, she's gonna be one years old. And yes, she does fit in a 3T. These really cute hot pink little shoes. They're like sneakers, adorable. I'm literally obsessed and I can't wait for her to start walking so she can wear these. And that's what we got Bianca. We literally got her so much more stuff for Christmas. So we didn't go too too crazy with her but Nelson on the other hand if you guys didn't watch a vlog from two days ago you would not know who Nelson is but he's a new baby in our life it's actually Bianca's younger cousin and he's nine months old he's the cutest little mush ever and if you guys would like to see him definitely be sure to check out my previous vlog and also stay tuned for more vlogs because he'll definitely be on my channel a lot more we decided to get him a whole bunch of stuff since we did not get him anything for Christmas we just met him for the first time on Thanksgiving and we're already in love with him so as you can see we just had to go ham so we got a cute little set of onesies here we did get a little bigger of a size just so he can grow into it he's much more petite than Bianca so we know that he'll get a ton of use out of this stuff some stuff we did get smaller so he can wear it from now we got him these cute little shoes he's literally about to start walking already and Bianca's just not so he'll probably get use out of his sneakers before Bianca does and then some really cute snow boots because it's gonna snow here at some point throughout the winter. This really cute set of waffle onesies that are long sleeve. This really cute onesie set. Everything from the boys department is so cute. Girls as well, but like the boy colors are just adorable. We got this cute little lovey snuggle toy and an elephant. I'm obsessed with elephants and this is just so soft and cuddly. And then another one similar, but this is a dino. And then we got him this dino beanie that has matching mitts again for the colder weather and the snow and stuff like that another one in this really cute green color and then we got him a set of short sleeve onesies these are more for his size for now and then over here is this waffle striped pajama or even just like an outfit and it has a dino on it i didn't realize how much dino stuff we got but like it's really cute here is a cute little sweat set absolutely adorable and this color red is just everything. One of me and my mom's favorite things is this adorable like sweater material sweat set. So these are these little like diaper style pants that are like saggy a little bit, but so cute. They're fitted like joggers. They have a cute little jawstring and this matching little sweater with a pocket and buttons and it has a matching hat that has little ears. He's gonna look adorable in this and I can't wait for him to wear it. And then this one is a camel -y. Is it camel? No, this is more of like a chocolate brown version of it, but it has this little pocket right here. It's absolutely adorable. And this color is gonna look so cute on him. And again, the same matching beanie for this whole set and I don't know if I mentioned but these socks as well for the winter because that's the time of year we're in but yeah so as you can see we got quite a lot of stuff mostly for the babies but it's just all so cute and you want to get everything when you're in the baby section and I just can't contain myself so I'm excited to give it all to them and see them in everything definitely be sure to stay tuned and follow me on my Instagram to see them both in all of their new things that's gonna be the end of today's video I really hope you guys enjoyed watching I will see you guys tomorrow in vlogmas day 9 when my mom and I are setting up my dad's entire house for Christmas stay tuned if you would like to see that subscribe and do all that fun stuff but yes, I will see you tomorrow. I love you so much and have an amazing day.